What is going on everyone? Welcome back to Kenny KO. Today I have a little bit of an update regarding the whole Elliot Atwell situation. Then make sure to watch my last video so you can see the full interview and what happened. But for those of you that are maybe new to the channel, to summarize as quick as possible, Elliot Atwell is a powerlifting coach who gained a name through David Laid and many other young athletes, who was under the accusations by this group for trying to solicit underage pictures. But the reason I'm even making this video is I try I tried to get Elliot on the channel. I tried to give him a chance to interview, but the guy is screaming guilty in my opinion. And let me tell you why. First red flag that happened was when I was filming my initial video, I was blocked on his Instagram out of nowhere. Second red flag was on his YouTube channel. He made all of his videos private, unlisted them basically removed them where no one's able to watch or comment. And now the third and final strike is Elliot Atwell files a privacy complaint on my video, which was the interview video, because he's doing anything he can to try and sweep this under the rug. So I'll go ahead and read part of the email from YouTube. It said, Dear Kenny KO, this is to notify you we have received a privacy complaint from an individual regarding your content. Hmm. I mean, I get, I wonder who it could be. And instead of marking an exact time of the video where their privacy was violated, they used the generic start of the video, but he put zero minutes in zero seconds, basically stating the whole video. Now on my channel, all my content falls under fair use and majority of my content is news related. So there's nothing there. I'm more so shocked that Elliot would take this approach because it shows to me and maybe to many of you watching that he's trying to hide the situation. He's not trying to own up to it, make himself better from it. Even like I mentioned, I gave him the opportunity on my last video to come onto the channel, defend himself, give his side of the story. But no, he wants to do whatever he can to silence everyone. If anyone is to take care of the scenario, it should be the authorities. And I hope the authorities have already been contacted because this type of offense is something that is so serious and needs to be dealt with immediately, not just for the Elliot Atwell situation, being David Lade's coach, big names are involved. But this actually happens more than you would think, especially with coaches who are male with female clients trying to solicit pictures. So yeah, this story all revolves around Elliot Atwell as the coach and the Gymshark young crew of athletes. But this one story can actually help so many individuals, maybe someone who is a client of a coach who now understands that they are crossing the line when they're asking for pictures or making them feel uncomfortable, that you're not forced to stay in that situation. And if you are underage, like many of these guys who are coming forward and speaking out against Elliot, go to the police because if you don't speak up about it what's going to happen is that individual is just going to continue to do the same thing if not to you to someone else but i just want to give you guys an update uh mostly this video is being posted in case my original video ends up being taken down so i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you're new to the channel make sure to subscribe if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to give the video a thumbs up and elliot be careful Die, ride or 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 die.